شیخ طریقہ تمیر علیہ سنت دا فاؤنڈر آف دعوت اسلامی علامہ مولانا ابو بلال محمد الیاس افطار قادری رضوی ضیائی دامت برکات الحالیہ ہیز اسٹیٹڈ آن پیج سیونٹین آف ہز بک لیٹ سیلفی کے تیس عبرت ناک واقعات پیرلز آف سیلفی مینیا سیلفی لورز آر فاؤنڈ پرسوئنگ دیئر پیشن فار سیلفیز ڈیورنگ دا سیکرڈ پلگرم ایج فار حج اینڈ عمرہ دے انسٹینٹلی ٹیک اے سیلفی ایٹ اے پلیس دے لائک اینڈ پوسٹ اٹ آن دا سوشل میڈیا میک ان اٹ پبلک سیلفیز آر ایون میڈ وائل کسنگ حجر اسود اور پرفارمنگ طواف اینڈ سعی وچ ڈسٹربز دا فلو آف دوز ہو پرفارم طواف اینڈ سعی پیپل کلائڈ اور فال اوور ایچ ادر which cause great difficulty to them. In an attempt to take selfies while worshipping, the selfie-taken people lost their own concentration and devotion as well. Some people are found taking selfies even near the blessed golden grill in front of the sacred Muwaja. Some overly bold people even turn their back towards the sacred Muwaja for taking a selfie. Would that we could make our mind that the privilege to sacred haraman is for earning reward, not for taking selfies. Haram ki zami aur kadam rakh ke chalna, aray sar ka mauka hai aur jane wale. Sallu ala al-habib sallallahu ta'ala ala muhammad sallallahu ta'ala alayhi wa sallam. Dear viewers of Madani channel, the fortunate people who are privileged to perform hajj and umrah should bear in mind the manners of visiting these sacred pieces abstaining from useless conversations and the unnecessary use of mobile phones they should continue to do zikr of allah azawajal recite the holy quran salat al nabi and invoke tasbih and tahleel all the time in addition to these they should also bear in mind the parables of pious saints and the practices they used to adopt during the pilgrimage and visit of these sacred places inshallah azawajal by virtue of its blessings the yearning for hajj will be increased let's listen to three parables of pious saints about the pilgrimage for hajj number one a person humbly said to sayyidina hatim asan rahmatullahi ta'ala le, tell me about the traveling companion in whose company I may reach in the court of Allah Azza wa Jal because I have intended to go on a pilgrimage for Hajj. He Rahmatullahi Ta'ala Leh said, O oh brother, if you want a companion, make recitation of the Holy Quran. Your companion, if you want a comrade, make angels your comrades. If you want a friend, so Allah Azza wa Jal is the honor of the hearts of his friends. If you want provisions, For the journey, believe in Allah Azawajal is the best provisions. Considering the Holy Kaaba to be in front of you, perform tawaf happily. Number two, when Sayyidina Shibli Rahmatullahi Ta'ala was privileged to have wukuf Arafat, stay at Arafat in Hajj on 9th Zul Hajj. He Rahmatullahi Ta'ala remained absolutely silent. Rahmatullahi Ta'ala Leh did not utter even a single word till sunset. When he Rahmatullahi Ta'ala Leh passed Milan Akhdaran, during Sa'i, tears started flowing from his eyes and he recited the following couplets. I am walking in such a state that I have set the seal of your love on my heart so that no one else can enter it except you. When the tears start rolling down, your cheeks it becomes obvious who's really weeping and who's just acting number three it has been narrated that sayyidina abu jafar muhammad bin ali bin hussein ali bin abi talib rahmatullahi ta'ala le, left for hajj when he entered masjid al haram he rahmatullahi ta'ala le, started weeping bitterly and loudly as he saw the holy kaaba He Rahmatullahi Ta'ala was humbly asked, Undoubtedly, people are looking at you. Please do not weep so loudly. He Rahmatullahi Ta'ala replied, Why should I not weep? Perhaps due to my weeping, Allah Azza wa Jal will have mercy on me and I will succeed in his court on the day of judgment. He Rahmatullahi Ta'ala then performed tawaf of Baitullah 
and offered salah at maqam ibrahim when he rahmatullahi ta'ala lifted his head from sajda the place of sajda was wet with his tears sallu ala al habib sallallahu ta'ala ala muhammad sallallahu ta'ala alayhi wasallam madani channel we love madani channel we love madani channel